Clackamas Community College Speech and Debate Team is on the move. The team meets Monday and Wednesday from 3 to 6 during the forensic season, which lasts until the end of April. So you know I have the opportunity to talk with Carrie Hughes to learn more about the speech and debate team here at CCC. My name is Carrie Hughes and I am the director slash advisor for the Clackamas Community College Speech and Debate Team. The team competes in a lot of different areas. Um, we have individual events which range from doing impromptu speaking, extemporaneous speaking, to informative or persuasive platforms. We also do after dinner speaking or communication analysis, which is what we call our limited prep area also. And then we also have what we call interps, which is where you take a piece of literature and you actually create it in a story format kind of from your perspective, but using the words of an author. So it's like this real interpretive, you know, event where they really get to be creative and kind of think of a theme and bring it all together. We got the chance to meet some of the forensic team members. When you are in the extemporaneous event, you start out by going to, at least during competition, you start out by going to the wall where they've posted the event, or excuse me, the extemp questions that they give you. So all of your topics are actually questions in extemporaneous in that limited prep event. And so depending on which speaker you are, you have a different set of questions. So as soon as they call your speaker number, then you head up there and you get a choice of three questions. So once you pick your question, you get to decide how you're going to answer that. And so you go and you meet who you are, your opponent, and there are usually five different topics that you can choose from. And the negation, who is in, um, they are against what is, what the resolution is, they are going to strike first, so they'll cross one out that they don't want to debate about, and then the affirmation strikes the next one, and then you strike until you have one resolution left, and then that resolution is what you are debating. The hardest part about speech and debate competitions, for me at least, definitely would be the prep time before I actually have to speak. The speaking time is actually really fun, and that's the funnest part for me, but it's the prep time where actually figuring out everything that you have to say during your speech that's the most challenging. But I think the biggest thing that I do to try and prepare our students for a competition is to really encourage them that the effort that they put into this is also the effort that they will get out of this. And speech and debate taught me discipline. Speech and debate taught me team building skills. It taught me how to be a team player. It taught me how to have confidence in myself. It taught me how to do research. It taught me how to do time management. It taught me how to create argumentation. Like the list really could go on and on and on. With Nationals in Kansas City fast approaching, the team is primarily to represent CCC and we wish them the best of luck.